downloading the Huawei AI Life app onto your smartphone. The same process both for Huawei's App Gallery and Google Play Store. Go into Huawei's App Gallery, you click on the search button, click AI Life, and click search, and you install. It will then install your application onto your mobile smartphone. So now I'm going to show you how to connect your Q2 Pro with your router. So we, what we have to do is you take your LAN cable and you plug it into your WAN port at the back of your Q2 Pro main base station and plug it in like that. You get your power cable and you plug it into your power socket. Your Q2 Pro will then light up red and it is now connected to your router. Setting up your AI Life app to your Q2 Pro. Once you go into the AI Life app, it should automatically give you a prompt to configure your Huawei Q2 Pro. Click on configure, then agree to terms and conditions and click get started. It will now ask you to set up your own password. You can create your own one or you can use the same password that's on your original router. At the bottom, it also asks you to create an admin password. This admin password is for the AI Life app for later on when you need to gain access into your Q2 Pro. So I'm just going to make admin one. And then also my pass, I'm going to confirm that password. And at the bottom, you click next. Once you click next, it'll save your settings and try and reconnect to the router and log into your Q2 Pro. Click on next. This is where you connect your other two Q2 Pros in the box. You plug them into the walls and you click get started. It will then push you all the way back to your main page on your AI Life app. You click on the Huawei Wi-Fi online. You put in your admin password. And at the bottom you click next. You are now in your main interface for your AI Life app for your Q2 Pro. Adding additional Q2 Pro to the system, click on the picture of the Q2 Pro. You click the plus on the right hand side of the screen and follow the prompts. Plug in the router directly into the wall socket as well as then you go and click next and it will scan for the Q2 Pro and once it has found it, it will automatically connect and configure to your mesh Wi-Fi. Other functionality in the AI Life app, you can create a parental control where you can add a device and select where you want it to connect and when you want it to disconnect during the day. And you can also repeat that functionality every single day for specific devices. So if you've got children that are using the Wi-Fi, you can set this up for them and choose their specific device that they are using. You can also create a guest Wi-Fi with a name as well as a different password. So when people come over to your place or to into your office, they can connect to the guest Wi-Fi and you can also select how long you want them to be able to connect to that Wi-Fi. You can also do a diagnosis on the system to find out if there's any issues within your system or network. And you can also see how many devices are connected to your mesh Wi-Fi at any given time. You can also see what your connected status is. You can also see how good your internet connection is, um, whether it's got an uh, excellent or a good or a poor connection. You can also see that on your AI Life app. Other additions at the bottom where it says show more, click on that. You can see any updates. You can also control your Wi-Fi management, your network settings and your router settings individually as well. So you have quite a few functionalities in your AI Life app for your Q2 Pro.